Thank you. Ah, that looks good. Ooh. That was a good lunch. So, uh, yeah. So today is the 28th of February, and it's the first day of the Service 135 Amendment, and we are going to check it out. So, yeah. say hi, Zach. So, yeah. So, yeah. Actually, we're walking the wrong way. It's, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. <laughs> okay. So you join us here at Kembangan MRT which service 135 has been amended to as of today. Uh, before today, service 135 used to look at Siglap Road from Amokyo. So, yep, this is the MRT station. This is a C151B. And yeah, let's head over to the bus stop. So actually, there are two bus stops at Kembangan MRT Station. One is the main one over there, but that's not the one that we are going to today. So we're going to cut through the station to get to the other bus stop. We station! Yeah, very exciting. They've got trains on top of us. <laughs> which, wait, which exit is this? Uh? <laughs> exit B. B. Exit B, okay? Yeah, so then the... The service 135 is amended to Kembangan Station Exit B. Look, Kembangan has sitaros now. Actually, it already had sitaros before, just that I think it's not very common. Ah. Remember the days when it had daddy's darts? That is before I started filming buses, a very long time ago. Actually, yeah, there's a sheltered lingway. I don't know why are we like walking in the sun instead of in the sheltered lingway. I mean, being in the sun is the best thing in the world, I guess. That's not true. It's like how the vessels are the best car in the world. Oh no, 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 no. Uh, okay, yeah. yeah, actually this car, this walkway is quite long. It's from all the way there. So that's the station and this is So you'll be are. sheltered if there is rain. That is good. That's true. So we are reaching the bus stop and there doesn't seem to be any service 135 bus here yet. It's just two bus 42s. Ah. Yeah, I guess if we stick around long enough, there'll be a 135 that will come along shortly. Good, didn't know they bought the bus while they were parking there. Yeah. The bus stop. Yeah, I thought they would be at the bus stop too. Uh, yeah, you can see the 135 has just been added. Service number. <laughs> so yeah, this place seems... With those two Scania's there, it seems like it, it gives out a KL vibe. But yeah. like a cheaper KL vibe because there's no boarding boards at all. So yeah, this is the amendment poster. If you have seen my previous video on the preparation for the move, you probably will, this will probably be familiar to you. Uh. So yeah, let's just wait until a service 135 bus comes along. Uh. So finally, here comes a service 135 Sitaro. Oh, the DS is different now. Yeah, Jalan Kembangan. Uh. Doesn't say Kembangan MRT. Oh, that looks delicious. On a hot day like this, I would love to have some ice cream actually. So yeah, the bus will park here after alighting passengers. I'm not sure about the boarding procedure though. What do you think is the boarding procedure? It's either they walk up to the bus or the bus reverses into the bus stop. I don't think it will reverse in uh. so I guess it will be like 42 uh, where the passengers will walk from the bus stop to the bus over here. Uh. Also the advertisement is the same colour as the bus. Oh yeah, a lush, lush green feeling. Uh, I think. Oh. Oh. For electric bus but... Yeah, I don't, I'm not sure if there are any electric buses today though. I mean today is only the first day so maybe they didn't deploy any today. Not very sure. We are here now, Kembangan Station. This is the entire sector in purple that has been amended. This part here is the part that has been cut out. Uh. And one thing I noticed when I joyride this route right, is that usually those uh, elderly folks right, that live along Marine Parade Road, if they stay on bus stops on this side of the road, 
they will tend to take the bus around the loop and back instead of getting off and crossing the road. So considering the fact that this entire part of the route is now gone, I wonder what alternatives there are for them. Hmm? I guess I hope they have a different alternative because... Uh... Because 135 is the only bus that loops at Siglap, Siglap Road. Oh, 135 is departing. The bus captain actually called for any passengers who are taking 135, but doesn't seem to be anybody boarding. So, yeah. I mean, I've seen one floor of this uh, new terminus point where mm. the bus captain has to come to the bus stop to uh, has to come to the bus stop to call the passengers for what services they are taking. If it, this is how it's gonna be, what if it's raining? Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's, that's a good point, a uh, actually. Oh, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, because the shelter is here only, so... so that if it's... The bus has to reverse the bus stop to pick up the passengers. Yeah, so if it's raining, I guess... <laughs> yeah, maybe you'll come back one day when it's raining and see what's the procedure. I, I really have no idea. So, uh, let's go further up along the road and wait for this bus to pass by. Uh. So off it goes to the roundabout. It should be right back here shortly. And off it goes to Amokyo. And here comes the next bus 135. So yeah, I think we've pretty much covered all of what this place has to offer. And this bus should be the next one to depart. I mean, it's the only 135 here now. So let's board it later when it's ready to depart. Oh, so if the bus parks at the first lot, then the passengers has to walk all the way from there.
Oh, that's a nice GT3. Okay, that marks the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. See you next time.